Hello everyone. Today we're going to talk about delete operation in hashing. So let's explain uh, like uh, this operation, the delete operation with some examples. So here we have a hash table of size 6, so m is equal to 6. And also we have uh, this uh, popular function uh, that is the modulus uh, hashing function. So the h of k is equal to k modulus of number 6, that m because m is equal to 6 here. And let's also assume that we have these numbers that's going to be inserted. These are the arrow keys. So the module of 0 and 6 is equal to 0, so we are putting 0 here. The module of 1 and 6 is equal to 1. The module of 7 by 6 is equal to 1. But because here the uh, item 1 is occupied the location 1, so let's say that also we are using the linear problem, so it will be inserted here at this location. And also the last number that we have here is number 4. That's uh, the model of number 4 and 6 is equal to 4, so we are going to insert it here. So, so far, there is no problem. The problem arises when we are going to like delete some numbers in this hash table. Let's assume that we are going to delete number 1. Okay, so the first scenario is that we just simply number 1 and this spot will be deleted. So that's going to be... So we're deleting 1. And simply what happens is that we have number 0 here, we have number 7, and also we have number 4 here. So now let's say that we are going to search for item, four, uh, item 7. So based on the hash function, the search operation finds the uh, like the hash value that's going to be 7 modulo of 6, that is going to be 1. It looks at this location and because it's empty, it assumes that number 7 doesn't exist. Although the number 7 is in the hash table, but the, research, the search is unsuccessful. So how we can solve that? The problem was that we deleted the one, uh, we just uh, deleted the item number one and we made it empty. But if we just mark this location as some special mark, and uh, let's call it a, like a tombstone, then when we are looking for the item and we see some uh, location that are marked as a tombstone, then we are continuing our, our, continuing our search. So let's look at the problem. Let's look at the example again. So let's say that we deleted number one. And instead of making it empty, we are just marking that location as a tombstone. Now we are looking for number seven. And based on the hash uh, function, the item will be at this location. Uh, first, we're going to search at this location. But because this item is not here and also the uh, location marked as tombstone, we are continuing the search. And because we use the linear problem, so it's going to find the item 7 here. So we can uh, find that. This is not uh, the only use of the using the tom uh, tom uh, tombstone in uh, delete operation of hashing. So also, we can use the uh, deleted location for insertion. So for example, let's say that we are going to add another number. Let's say we're going to add number 13. We're going to add number 13. So this 13 modulo of 6 is equal to 1. So here we have this uh, item at location here that is uh, like the, where we had the tombstone. And this location can be inserted, uh, can have the number uh, 13. So our new hash table will have these numbers. We have number 0 here, we have number 13, number 7, and here number 4. And when we are looking for number 7 now again, because number 13 is here, so it's occupied, so it tries to find the number 7 on the next uh, spot that's going to be here, number 7, and it turns number 7 successfully. Although the tombstone is a good way and it has some advantages, but also it has its own disadvantages. So, and the problem is that as uh, when you have like the bunch of like insertion and deletion, then the, some of the items that are in the, uh, in the table have a, a very, uh, maybe might have, a, uh, might be far from the, their home position. 
So let's say that you have one item that should be at the uh, index two, but now because of like tombstones and the deletion, now it's uh, inserted a location 10. So for search operation, instead of like uh, going after this uh, location two, then finding for example location, uh, looking for location at uh, location three, we need to continue because we have all these tombstone location until we find the uh, location number 10. So let's look at uh, the example. Here we have this item that we have. Let's say we have this um, number two here. And we have another item that's at this location. And all of these items that you see here, they're all now the tombstone. So what we can, uh, uh, what happens is that you, we need to search for all of these items here until we find the number 10. So one fix can be like reorganizing the items after some are like the deleting of the numbers or the items. So for example, when we are doing some uh, like a delete operation, we can move uh, like the latest item, for example, to the items that we are deleting. So for example, move the 10 here. So it uh, increases the search operation speed because now we move 10 to a closer location to the home position. Or for example, we can rehash the table and reinsert the numbers that we have uh, just to make sure that our, uh, the search operation is fast.